bud. Hope everyone doing good today. Today we're going to cover the Genesis 3 and 8 to 9 pose converter. Okay. Um, okay, so there is a free one which I've covered. I'll link it in this one. Hopefully I know how to do that. I don't know how to do nothing. All right. Anyway, uh, the one is free. This one, a little bit more expensive. At 25 bucks people 25 bucks now why would you take a 25 buck one okay okay it's on sale i suppose they go on sale that's all good but why would you take one that's already free and over here 25 bucks okay it's quite an ask it's quite an ask for free so uh the other one you know you've always got to load a character do the pose on the other character and then match them up once you've loaded the character the rest is quite straightforward i it's straightforward, but, you know, if you want to be lazy, okay, first of all, you get the utilities, you can save it, this one is just running it, this one is adding the script here, if you double click it, you can say remove or add script, I've already added it, so it gives me remove, uh, then all you gotta do, all you gotta do, all you gotta do there, boy, is go get a, go get a, go, go get a pose, okay, let's take, uh, flying, falling, ugh, Okay, yeah. You select the pose you want. You go to scripts, it'll be up in your scripts folder, and you'll see it here, G3 and 8, 9, pose converter. Click that shit, and boom! Okay, then you get some nice options. Genesis 8, because it's a Genesis 8.1. Uh, drop to floor, which is quite nice. Drop to floor. Use figure limits. You can add the, the limits on the figure, which is pretty cool. It doesn't look exactly the same. It really doesn't. Th I've noticed with a couple of figures, it's not exactly the same. The nice thing is you can mirror the pose right on the thing. This gives you an assigned keyboard shortcut, which I really like. That's cool. And then remove the pose converter, which I don't know why you'd want to do that. Anyway, once you've done that, you can see here, though, it's not the same. It's not the same. But it's close. It's close. This hand looks like it's higher up. Uh, I, it looks like you've got to tweak quite a bit of it. In all honesty, the free one, the free one kind of works a little bit better. Hold up, hold up, yo. Okay, so let's test it. I've got eight here. Uh, let's put them pose on a mate. Let's put them pose right on a mate. Let's take that one that was. Uh, uh, which one was it? Falling. Okay, so I'm going to apply this to Wolfgang. Right, so there. There we go. There's the benchmark, people. People. Then we're going to take this one, right? Um, and then it says select G9 hip. So I'm going to take a Nosferatu. Nosferatu. And then I'm going to take the Wolfgang, the hip, and accept. Right? So there we go. Cool. Now, let us go back to them smart content, okay, and see what we can do with this one. Uh, so, once again, I've got to go, uh, what do I, what do I got to do? What do I got to do, Kyle? What do I got to do, Kyle? Okay, so, I highlight that one, I go to scripts, and I do this. Please select, okay, 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 brah, okay, no need to go mental. And there we go, so... I see a difference. Let's see, it's Genesis 8. Actually, 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 it's spot on. Spot on, mate. Yeah, spot on. Uh, include translation data, include floor limits. Let's see. Uh, actually, that could even be more accurate. Huh. 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 Let's see. Uh, that is more accurate. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so you can get great results with both. This one you get options with, which is quite cool. And it does look a bit more accurate. The hand looks a little bit higher on this one. That's the free one. And this one does look a little bit more down, which you get the options to put on limits or not. Okay, so if you're looking for absolute pinpoint accuracy, accuracy then you're good. Let's try it with one more. Let's try it with one more. Okay, let's try it with this. Let's uh, let's y'all see. Tell me what you want, what you really, really want, what you really, 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 really want. Uh, let's apply this to the Genesis 9 Nosferatu scripts and go there. Yeah, we going there. Yeah. Ugh, this is so awkward. Give us the option to move around, man. 
Give us the option to move around. When you use the script, you can't do anything. Damn it, man. Damn it, man. Right, so we're doing this. Use figure limits. I can see subtle changes. Not nothing too much. Okay, let's just use uh, that. Cool. And then let's go to the free one. Let's go to the free one. And run the script and say G9 Nosferatu. Nosferatu. And Wolfgang, Nosferatu. Right, and accept. Boom. So, uh, actually both are looking pretty damn good there. Okay, so, I mean, it works. It works. I'd say you have more options with the 25 buck one. Okay. <laughs> uh, and it's way less work with this one. Uh, so, the free one which you'll find in the description or whatever i'll link it um but the free one is a little bit more time say 15 seconds okay uh the other one is quick so i mean if you're trying to change poses constantly you're going to save a lot of time but you got to pay for it you got to pay for it okay and the other one is totally free but it does take a little longer to do and and the the paid one by zev and uh uh who's 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 the dude Bitwelder, 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 Bitwelder and Zevo, uh, you know, it's a lot quicker to use as, there's a, there's a couple more options, you can put it up in your scripts, they've always, they always do a nice job, okay, so they've done a nice job, but you can see, you can get really good results with both of them, they look pretty much exactly the same, I can't really see a difference, I can't see a difference, can you, can you see a difference there, boy? I can't see, except this one puts it on the floor for you, Bob. Yeah, I mean, perfect. Perfect fit, mate. That's a perfect fit you got there, mate. It's exactly the same. So, paid version. Look, man, I like speed. Uh, my middle name is Speed. So, uh, you know, I paid for it. I got it on a sale, which is pretty good. And it works really well. So... I think we're good. Uh, I like it. You know, I like I like these kind of products. But if you don't want to pay for something, there's a free one. I'll link it. I'll link it. Okay? I'll link it for you. But uh, that's Genesis... Uh, what is it called? What what did they go, man? Genesis 3 and 8 to 9 post converter. And it's wicked. It works. It's a good product. Uh, I, I like it. I recommend it for those that don't want to mess around. Just want to get a pose done. Go for it, mates. And it's pretty damn accurate. All right, thanks for joining me and I'll speak to you guys later. Bye guys.